Rich Thomas Weather Network, brought to you by these fine sponsors. Hear Rich's forecast hourly on these Blue Water Broadcasting Radio stations. Hey, good morning, everybody. Rich here on this special Saturday morning video. Uh, it is uh, way before dawn, and uh, I want to bring you up to date on uh, the severe weather risk today. There's already tornado watches in Mississippi as I make this, and some tornado warnings as well. And I want to drive home a couple of points. First of all, all of us are under a severe weather risk today, and that's all modes of severe weather, including damaging winds, hail, and the possibility of tornadoes. But some parts of the state are in a stronger risk than other parts. So I want to try to give you an idea of who has the strongest risk and the possible timeline to give you an idea of your day ahead. So let's get started here this morning. You ready? Here's the map at 1 o'clock today showing the strong cold front on the Mississippi River and a squall line out ahead of it, probably already in Alabama by that time. Now, I want to shade this wide shot from the Storm Prediction Center because we have viewers of this video all over South Alabama. All of the state is in the severe weather risk, all the way down to the wire graphs. Uh, the greater enhanced risk, the orange area, covers about the western half of the state of Alabama. And I want to show you, there's a lot of good details in this local map from the National Weather Service in Birmingham. The yellow slight risk area, tornadoes are possible, damaging winds 60 miles per hour or higher. In the orange enhanced risk, the tornado threat is stronger, generally west of a Gadsden to Montgomery line. And uh, in the hatched area in northwest Alabama from uh, Demopolis and Birmingham northwestward, a couple of strong tornadoes. Tornadoes are possible today. Timeline from as early as 11 a.m. in the far west to 2 a.m. in the far east and southeast Alabama and the Montgomery area, probably somewhere between you know 5 p.m. and 11 p.m. But that's just uh, a rough estimate. Let's look at uh, future radar as the squall line now in Mississippi, as I make this early in the morning, moves into northwestern Alabama and then into western Alabama and migrates eastward during the daytime hours today and into the evening hours tonight. Here's a snapshot. Don't take this literally, but the, here's an idea at 8 o'clock tonight that a strong squall line could be from about, let's say, Clanton to, um, you know, uh, near Selma, down to Mobile, 11 p.m., perhaps uh, closer to the Montgomery area, moving on eastward, maybe not quite as strong at that hour uh, as it was earlier in the day. Then at 2 o'clock in the morning, uh, down to around, let's say, Troy, and moving into southeast Alabama, and moving in towards the Auburn area, but not quite as strong at that hour, perhaps. Rainfall potential, well, this is going to be a soaker. One to two inches across southeast Alabama. We need the rain. Two to three inches in the central counties. Maybe three to four inches plus across parts of northwest Alabama. And there is a flash flood watch in effect now. Let's say northwest of a line from Clanton to Selma with this storm system. So we're looking for 81 today. Showers and thunderstorms become um, almost a certainty tonight and through the early part of the day tomorrow before ending. Then breezy, cooler 64. Only 63 Monday and maybe down to 39 on Tuesday morning. We'll be back up near 80 again on Wednesday. It's going to be a busy day, folks, and uh, hopefully you have our weather app on your phone or tablet. Uh, if you don't get it on your phone today, it's going to be your best friend with uh, interactive uh, radar and uh, pu instant push notifications for watches and warnings. So that's it. Uh, stay weather aware today. I know you will. And keep our weather app handy. It's going to be your best friend today. And, uh, of course, I'll stay on top of all the whole situation. i got a few things to do this morning. But uh, from lunchtime on, I'll be uh, in the driver's seat watching the weather for you. And uh, you can uh, feel free to share this post with uh, anybody else that you want to so that everybody gets the word about the severe weather threat. Have a good day today. Stay weather aware, and I'll see you later.